All right, well, stay tuned. Thanks, Ed. With a slight increase in COVID-19 cases around the state, doctors are warning that summer gatherings can still be easy targets for transmission. WHO 13's Natalie Painter joins us now with more on what local medical professionals are saying about the upcoming months. Natalie. Well, Erin and Janae, an infectious disease specialist with Mercy One tells me that this season may have the least amount of COVID guidelines since the start of the pandemic, and that can be a cause for concern as we head into summer gatherings like graduations, summer camps, and concerts. So, you know, with the most of the cases being of Omicron variant, which is very, very easily transmittable of all the variants we've known so far, even the Delta variant that we had earlier. The transmission is very easy and you know 90% um, of the people out there, they are not wearing a mask even in gatherings uh, and a lot of you know gatherings are happening. With people who are fully vaccinating still still developing the virus, medical professionals tell us that symptoms in fully vaccinated adults and healthy children can mimic allergies. So there is even more confusion during this season's recent increase of cases. Um, uh, I, I just think that people should just pay attention to uh, their normal allergy symptoms versus something different. But I would certainly recommend with the high transmission that's going on, even with allergy symptoms that are lasting you more than a few hours, you know, you come in the house and you feel fine, that's okay. But if your allergy symptoms continue, please test yourself and isolate yourself. Uh, if you do test yourself with an at home kit, check the expiration date if you've had it a while. The CDC warns that many have a shelf life of about six months, Janae. Yeah, always a good reminder to check those dates. Thanks, Natalie.